The month of Ramadan is nearing its end. During this month, Muslims from all across the globe fast from dawn to dusk every day. At the end of month of Ramadan, Muslims celebrate Eid. After Eid, everyone has some difficulty going back to how things were before Ramadan, since it takes time to adjust back from the month of fasting and almost inverted routines. So here are some tips to help in a smooth transition from fasting back to normal daily routine while keeping the good habits you built in Ramadan and letting go of any bad ones. Number 1. Try lighter foods and use your decreased appetite to your advantage. Fasting in Ramadan usually gets your body used to low caloric intake which means you can survive the day on much less food. It also makes you less hungry for food and decreases appetite. If you've been meaning to lose weight, you can use this decreased appetite by intermittently fasting as it should be easier for you to do so right after Ramadan. Number 2. Keep the habit of having a proper breakfast with lots of hydration first thing in the morning. Put some time and effort into making yourself a nice, elaborate breakfast and preferably fresh juice to get your day started on the right foot. Number 3. Say bye-bye to oily foods and hello to a balanced diet. During Ramadan, some of us may binge eat oily and fried foods. This is not very healthy, so try and let go of that habit and make sure to get a balanced diet with fibers, fruits, dairy products, the whole shebang. Number 4. Maintain the early to bed, early to rise routine. As in Ramadan, you wake up early for sahur, so try to maintain that early rising habit, get some fresh air, try some meditation. Rising early really helps you take control of your day. Number 5. Hydrate tons and don't forget to sip water all day long. Hopefully, Ramadan has taught you the value of water. Keep a water bottle with you and try to finish it at least twice a day. Number 6. Set a time for workout. Try to maintain the weight you lost or lose the weight you gained. Let's get the daily workout habit back. During Ramadan, many people partake in the Travi prayers, which can go on for upwards of two hours. After Ramadan, you can substitute this time slot with a workout session. Exercise combined with other things on the list should get you in exceptional shape in no time. Number 7. Sleep Schedule your brain may have become used to waking up at sahar times, making it almost frustrating to wake up in the middle of the night only to find no food awaiting you. To get yourself back on track, make sure to not consume any caffeine for at least 4 hours before bedtime. Make sure to turn off any and all lights. All these things should get you through the transition from Ramadan to no Ramadan easily. Hope Hope you enjoy healthy days, good meals and exceptional drinks while also taking care of your body. Wishing you all a happy Eid. Don't forget to like and subscribe.